We are called to be a light in the darkness. Sometimes all it takes is a spark. Let love explode and bring the dead to life. Hello, I'm Ted Baer, publisher of MovieGuide.org. And I'm Evie Bear Carroll, his daughter, and this is your family guide to movies and entertainment. The third God's Not Dead is coming out. What is this one called now? A Light in Darkness. There you go. It's probably the best of the God's Not Dead movies. In terms of structure, it's very well done. It starts out with a severe problem. Pastor Dave's church, which has been in the community and founded the college, which was then taken over by the state, has been there for, you know, 100 years or so. But then the church blows up because somebody throws a rock through the window, they knock the gas canister, it all blows up. Now this is very serious. And then the school decides, the college decides to take over the property so they can build a student union because there's no place for church in universities today. Well, this movie is a lot about the issues that we're talking about today in culture. It is today's issues. It's issues of the state excluding Christians. It's the issues of universities uh, looking down on Christians. It's the issues of the people who are in the university who actually uh, like the Christians, but they can't tell anybody that they like the Christians. So Pastor Dave hires his brother, his name Pierce, to come in, who's a lawyer, who's left the faith. Uh, so Pastor Dave is an on-fire Christian. Pierce is questioning it, but he wants to help his brother. They have to fight for the church, and something unique happens in the process. I'm not going to tell you about it because it's a complete transformation, and it's one of the most positive, uplifting, great endings that you'll see in a movie. There's a lot of good acting, directing, and script writing in this movie. Take a look at the full review at movieguide.org. Without grace is our goal. We're just fighting. How do you define truth exactly? I believe truth is a person. Don't forget, we are called to be a light in the darkness. Let love explode and bring the dead to life.